Hey guys, I'm back again, and now we're, um, today we're going to talk about, uh, cracking programs, and, uh, what it can be used for, how to do it, and stuff like that. Now, before we start, I have to say this every time, but we, uh, can't be just cracking any program. We have to, uh, have permission. This has to be used for educational or on your own program purposes used for debugging and all kinds of other stuff like that. Don't don't use it. It can be illegal. You agreed to whatever the software does, and I will be uninstalling the cracked version of WinRAR. And I will do this on screen so you know I don't have it. And I tried to crack Androller, but that didn't work. So we're going to run as administrator, resource hacker. Hopefully I'll link this in the description. Go to file, open recent, WinRAR, exe. Then we're good. Dialog. Well, didn't mean to do that. You can remove or edit all any of these. You just need to find a uh, uh, reminder. I think this might already be a cracked copy because reminder's not here. Oops. Recent. Reminder right here. This annoying little pop up that always comes up when you open Win WinRAR. We all hate it, and so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get rid of it. Right click, delete resource, yes. I'm gonna go to file, save as. We're gonna put this on my desktop. So WinRAR underscore crack. I want to save it. Minimize this. Move you off of my wallpaper. And we we open it. We can click. Let's go in here and video. And we don't get the uh, annoying reminder. So you, once you're done, you can exit this out. And now you can pretty much just crack any program if there's something that bothers you in Oracle. Uh, get rid of it. Or change it. Now, um, just messing around, let's try to crack one of my programs. But it didn't did I run as a mystery. Yeah, I did. Let's go, uh, Trinity DDoS. File, open, desktop. Trinity DDoS. We only have the icon. Yeah, yeah we can't do anything. Let's, let's try... And it's kind of hard to find one that I can do, seeing as most of the programs I use are uh, open source. Now what we're going to do is we're going to move this copy of WinRAR to the trash. I'll go to my files, computer, uh, program files, scroll all the way down to WinRAR. Then WinRAR C, this is a crack, because I can open it and... No warning comes up, so we're gonna move you to trash. Yeah, continue. Now, when we open this one, that happens, so we know this is the original version of WinRAR. Exit this out. Empty my recycle bin. Now I no longer have a cracked version of WinRAR. And, uh, this, once again, only for demonstrational purposes and, uh, do not crack anything you don't own. I only did this for an example, and I deleted it right in front of you. Now, if we even search WinRAR, the only things that will come up are program files like WinRAR and WinRAR help. No, there are no crack files. 
And then there's just some WinRAR archives. And we get a WinRAR. And we only have the original WinRAR. So thank you guys for watching and see you next time.